Yo, what is going on, y'all? So, if you checked out the last video, then you saw that we did the first startup on the LSV Tech Civic. But unfortunately, in today's video, we did take a huge L, as you will see later on. But we will do everything in our power to get this thing ripping really, really, really soon. So, if you want to keep up with that, subscribe to the channel. Yo, what is going on, y'all? Check this out. I'm about to get a, a cut because it's long overdue. My boy over here about to bless me up real quick. I'll leave his link down below so you guys can hit him up if you're in Vegas. Check him out. Same spot, I mean the last video. This flavor is just goaded. I don't know why, I just like it. Top tier. All right, yo, what is going on, y'all? So before this video begins, I did pick up another goat, so you guys already know. But before this video begins, make sure you go down below and hit the subscribe button, because we're so close to hitting our goal for this year, which is 500. We're like at 300 or something right now. I always say that in every video, but it's because we're trying to hit our goal. So go down below, hit the subscribe button, enjoy the video. Yo, what is going on, y'all? So today is we are doing more content. And this guy is EJ8, the LSV Tech EJ8. So the only couple things he needs left is <clears throat> the cooling, basically. So this is radiator, the Mishimoto radiator. And what else, the coolant? Oh, uh, yeah. But I just need to put the coolant in there, bleed it, and then it should be good to go. It should be good for its first rips. Yeah, it's a, it has a tiny oil leak. <clears throat> it has a tiny oil leak. We're going to try to diagnose it right now and see what the problem is, see where it's coming from, fix it, bleed the coolant, give it some ribs. Where's the leak coming from? This car is low, bro. I can't even see. Oh yeah, I see it. It's coming from the drain plug. So we got the clutch bled. We just bled the clutch right now. Now we're about to do the coolant. As you can see, I do put all the coolant over there. We're about to do the coolant, bleed the coolant, and then we can begin the first rips. So these wires are actually bad. These are all old. They don't work anymore. He was probably like, yo, why does it don't have some that work? He actually, he ordered some new ones. They just haven't came in yet. They come in until Tuesday. Today is Sunday. So he's going to take the ones from his EM1 just to rip it up. These are no good though. But he does have some coming in on Tuesday, so... You gotta worry about that. All right, y'all. Cool little update on the tag. It is leaking right now because the the axle needs a new seal. So it's a leaky axle seal. So you gotta fix that. Then it'll be solid. But uh, check out this little update on the Integra. Check that out. And this thing does have a reverse camera. Actually, you gotta print reverse. It doesn't have a battery in it right now though. But the reverse camera to make you feel a little bit more modern. Does look pretty 90s in here, old school. But that gives a little bit of a modern touch. And then you can see the camera back here. Check that out. Get your focus. It's the camera right there. It's a cool little update for the tag. We're trying to see if we get some like wheels for it or things, like lower it a little bit, just to make it look a little more clean. Nothing too too crazy, but just something that looks pretty tight. All right, battery was in charge. About to give it a jump, give it a rip. See how it sounds. It was a battery that knocked you off. That's the one you're trying. All right, give us some ribs. This should be the final one, bro. Go. Just check it out, bro. That was cocky. Bro. 
Yo, what is going on, y'all? So, as you can see from the title, the LSV Tech Civic took a huge L. We're struggling to turn it on on Sunday. Today is Tuesday. We're struggling to turn it on on Sunday. It just wouldn't start. You know, it was, we thought it was the distributor, the spark plug wires. We couldn't find out what it was. But what it was is this dude had a little bit of gas and it was like old gas. And it didn't burn properly. So we put gas in there, primed it a few times, and it fired up. So we didn't get to give it any rips. We were hoping to give it rips in today's video, but unfortunately, it doesn't go into gear. So we bled the uh, we bled the clutch. We thought it was the slave cylinder, so we tried to fix that, and it still doesn't go into gear. What we're thinking is that the clutch is stuck and it doesn't want to engage. You need to get a racing clutch and flywheel kit but didn't put the racing flywheel because it didn't have a bearing. I didn't know if it was supposed to use a bearing or not, but that flywheel doesn't have one. The OEM one does. So we used the OEM one with the racing clutch and it. we thought it would work, but I don't know, maybe it's just stuck or the clutch is on backwards or something broke or something with the transmission. So we took an L. We got to drop the tranny again and see what is up because who knows, maybe it was even the clutch fork was on wrong or the throw out bearing was, isn't doing his job right or we didn't do something right. So we took a huge L on the LSV Tech Civic. It's not gonna be running as of now. We were hoping to get the first ribs going in today's video, but that is not possible. And we didn't get to do it. So it sucks, we took a fat L, but we are gonna come back from that. This thing's in a rip. I told them we're gonna find out what we're gonna do to this thing and we're gonna make this thing work. We're gonna make this thing go crazy. So that is it for this video. Again, took a huge L, but that's all right. We'll come back from it. Make sure you go down below and hit the subscribe button. We're so close to our goal. You can just go down and hit the button. Catch you guys in the next video. Peace.